Hello everyone, it's VJ332 for a little what's on deck, a couple of updates. Not a whole lot going on. I did a Kickstarter report the other day. Not too much to report since then. As far as Kickstarter is concerned, there's a couple of projects that were funded. There was a couple that failed, I think. At least one or two that failed. Um, <clears throat> However, first of all, if you have not entered my November contest. Make sure you do that. They still got a couple of weeks to go. If you did enter, I made an update to the uh, document. So now, when you enter, <clears throat> you not only enter the link to your video, but you also enter the name of your channel page. So that I know exactly what entry is what who it's from if you already entered you can go there and edit the uh should be able to edit your entry to add your channel name it'll make it easier for me if you don't you don't whatever mm -hmm. also my deck is now available the beatles a really two deck Probably it's about that my dad's doing something outside. And of course with the deck, it's a pretty nice deck of cards. The borders are a little bit excessively big. But whatever, it's a linen finish. Uh, it's got a nice 300 or so GSM stock. And you get pretty cool court cards. Custom, everything is custom. Basically. Custom pips and everything. You get that and card with my face on it you get a double backer and you know just a pretty cool deck it doesn't you know, I'll be honest it doesn't fan the greatest but if you get some fanning powder I'm sure that will fix that problem it does however spread decently and like I said it has a good stock and thinness <clears throat> I have about 14 or so left available at my store on Etsy.com I'll post the link in the description. If you haven't gotten this yet, don't wait anymore. Just go pick it up and get it done with because otherwise it's going to sell out. <clears throat> I already sold 11 and I got, if you did order, I got the packages done. They're in the mail. <laughs> It'll be, you know, very soon as they are. If you're in Canada, probably by the end of the week. If you're in the U.S., next week, if you're International might be a couple of weeks longer. Anyways, let's look at what's going on elsewhere. Illusionist, there's nothing really going on, but they do got their gaff system, as they call it, and a linking ring, linking rings effect coming up on the 19th, I believe. I guess that's when the Black Friday stuff starts. And I would not be surprised at all if there's a new deck. Fear 11, they got some things coming one of them was a, a trick using oreo cookies and then there was another one i forget what it was exactly and those coming soon and 311 has confirmed they have more decks i don't know how many more but more decks coming this year so expect to see them in the near future for black friday <clears throat> blue crown house of playing cards fairly silent nothing going on there aside from their usual sunday grunts thing Dan and Dave again, not a whole lot going on. They are selling, I believe, mystery decks, or will be. And they also got something coming that they say is 72 years in the making. I think that is the same thing that is involving that Juan Tamariz. <clears throat> and I'm coming soon to Kickstarter, hopefully the Origins playing cards. Uh, there's a, a deck, a bicycle gunslinger from a website called theconartist.com. This one's been a long time in the making, like two, three years. Looks like it's finally coming. 2,500 of those apparently. It's decent, uh, but not great, I guess. The, uh, <clears throat> Usi or Usai, however they pronounce, the company that has come out with the Blue Bloods and Blue Bloods Redux and 
Royal Optics and a couple other decks I think. It's got another one coming soon to Kickstarter which is the Pagan. And this, these ones are going to be borderless. They kind of remind me of a mix between Steamboat and Madison Dealers. And they are greenish color. Two colors apparently. They look pretty cool. Also David Blaine has confirmed he's got a new deck coming out. Again don't know when for sure. But I imagine for Black Friday it will be available. And out of everyone, he usually has the best deals. <laughs> so I'll definitely check it out. And I think he usually does is like a day before everyone else. Like a day before Black Friday. But I'll try to keep you posted. Mm, did I miss anyone? Uh, coming soon, in a few days I believe. In a week. The quality B playing cards. I don't know who's putting them out. Where you can get them. I've seen at least a red deck on eBay. But I believe there's red, blue, and black. These are just fairly standard B decks with a back design reminiscent of a lot of these other casino decks you see coming out, like the Dealers and I mean uh, the Madison Rounders and Ace Foldens and stuff like that. It just says quality on the back design. <clears throat> and there's, you know, not a whole lot else that I can think of. The Empire Plane Cards from Kickstarter apparently coming soon. Uh, Radical 80s should be coming soon, etc, etc. Also, I just hit 3,900 subscribers. Thank you everyone very much. And, and probably before the end of the year, I'll hit 4,000. That's great. And that's all I can think of. Stay tuned for a couple of reviews. I apologize for being a little absent yesterday and the day before. And but I got a couple of reviews coming your way today and tomorrow, and I'll see you next time.